What's good, doers? You know what it is. Know what it is. It's your boy, guy, back with another reaction video. Before we get into this, you know, do it with the like button, share button, subscribe button, post notification button, comment what you want to see us do next, like with us on Twitch. Now, do what you want to Twitch. We about to react to that Osama son. Likes music. Let's see, let me switch to Twitch, man. We on the kick, Twitch, YouTube, tap in, do what you got to do. We're about to get into the flex music. Uh, I've seen the creativity behind it all. It looked very creative. I like the videos. I liked it all. It was cool. We've seen the discourse. We know about the discourse. I'm trying to say the clone thing, whatever. I want to listen to the project and get into this myself and see what it's hitting for. How many songs here? 17. Just him? It's very low to start off. I can do it, fuck it up. Yelling in my dog cup. And your whole one fuck with us. I thought it's gonna pick her up. I'm still spinning in that truck. Do you want your hit or not? I just came in, clocked up. And I got a chop. Yeah, me and Roxy don't care. Try to knock our head. I've been pouring red. Appreciate you for that sub, gang. Finning down my head. I like, where's this? Cool 10 head. I like, finning with your hoe. You can get it. I was bullying on the east side with my fucking twin. Finna, I've been pouring red, finna down my head. I'm a nigga, I'm a nine, my head red. This is feel like a pound of red. I like all of my. First of all, we got mad people in the live right now. Um, I want you guys to hit the like button. Let's start with that. Let's start by hitting the like button so we can actually get this out there and we can all get involved and invested in this flex music um, reaction. Let's start with that. You know what I'm saying? Let's up these likes about another 40, you know? But I will start by saying Blonde was very bland to me. Wasn't really feeling it too much. Didn't get, to, like, usually I come to Osama Sun for the hype. Now, I'm glad that I was under, I was able to understand what he was saying. It wasn't too chopped up and choppy. So, and I know in a lot of other reactions, my complaints are, it's too chopped up. I can't really understand what he's saying. Now, I was able to understand what he's saying, and I like that. That's a plus. That's a sticker on the, on the, on the sticker board. You know what I'm saying? But what he was saying and how he said it, I don't really got a sticker for that. Not right now. Not right now. Not right now. Y'all like you could y'all agree? I mean if you can't, that's fine. I'm not here to sway anybody. Uh Baghdad. I'm 
it's definitely a lot more hype than the last song. It's definitely a little bit, not a little bit. It's, it's, it's some original Osama son, which is hype. Tells me that we're getting somewhere. Uh, it's not really, really catchy to me. Uh, the beat was great. Not great. The beat was, the beat will do. It could suffice. Don't, I'm not giving it a like though. It's not, it's not, you know, amazing. But I could definitely feel the energy in that track for sure. It's picking up. See, now they're getting creative and shit. All right, all right, right. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Let's play. Is it still echoing? I was just fucking on two best friends. Brand new for it, had a hit bent. Brand new for it, wanna get in. It's like a dog, make a pay for his ass. Bitch, he's not going for the win. Bitch. He's not going for the win. Bitch, he's not going for the win. Bitch, he's not going for the win. Flex, bang it on 10 by 10. Flex. 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 Oh, uh, okay, 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 okay. The beat, 
did better than Osama son. My snack for the reaction today is Gushers. Fucking these hoes up. The beat did better than Osama son. It's just my honest opinion on it. Um, I understand this is his flow. I don't mean it's catchy. Next. I don't understand. Like, this song is called Worst Part. How it feels to be in a position to have what? so many negative things being said to me. Like, so much negative shit going on. What? That's them. As far what? as like, yeah, my supporters know me. I'm starting to think that I'm hearing the same exact flow on just different types of beats. This flow is not for this beat. It's not. It's not. And I say that because I heard this flow on rage beats. I heard this flow on choppy ass beats. The beat hitting. But I just don't want to hear this type of flow on it. I don't live in pocket. I had three on funds on this. Yeah, tell her call me Benzo. Yeah, cause I got my Benzo. Watch her G's can't put my pants on. Watch her hoe, she got no manner. I just kicked it with a cancer. Watch my slot, cause he gon' blame me. I'll be back with a hundred bands. Me and my gang kill a hundred men. Twenty bands just right here, what you saying? I'm in the crib with a Glock and a chop. That's first lean, nigga, come in the shop. Sharing for so much long, I shot. Wish, wish you was here to see me pop. Worst, worst part is that, that's my dog. Worst part is that, that's my dog. Worst part is that, that's my dog. I'ma go slide till the niggas fall. I try I hear shit from all y'all, but I gotta keep it going. I told Slack I can't give up. Wish that you could pick up. I'm looking at the bigger picture. But just know look, cause I miss you. When I'm fed on top of my sister, I you know I ain't fucking with you. Fighting with red or yellow, nigga. To some fucking bands, worst part is you broke and mad. I, I just made a photo drive. Get for about a bitch and not. We finna go spend checks on that. Cup cover racks in this LV back. Brand new chain, I don't need no flash. Check in, man, gotta pay my slot. Late night working, you just slap. Put the to the hood and they like slime back. Slap a little he shoot it back. Shut him out, free my shit, no bell. Y'all ain't causing hell. Got, got some money through that mouth. You know, if I say anything, I'm a hater. If I don't go for the hype, I'm a hater. I'm old, punk. He doesn't get it. Uh, what else? What else? Oh, you like Jays? What else are they gonna say? What else? It's, they're, they're gonna go on and on. But somebody in the comments said it best. Somebody in the comments said it best. Let me. This is just a good beat tape with mumble over it. Beat to slapping. Quality is up to par. But what I'm hearing, like, and it's not even like I'm trying to listen for the lyrics. I'm not trying to listen for the lyrics. Hey, I wouldn't even mind if. He found a catchy way to say the same thing over and over again in a good amount of the parts of the track and have his little verse go on for himself or whatever. I'm not even catching that. Like, There's not even a part that I want to sing back to back for the next like 10 seconds.
not listening for the lyrics. I'm trying to catch a vibe. I'm trying to catch some hype. I'm trying to get ready to like, that's what I'm, you see the cup in hand? Come on, Tommy, I'm trying to tee up. I can't tee up though, like, I'm, I'm way too deep into this shit to know what the beat is doing for me and what the artist isn't. I'm way too deep into this shit to fall into that. You producer niggas, keep fucking going, man. That ass. Keep going, man. Y'all time is coming. Trust me, bro. Y'all time is coming, man. Sama son, I'm not saying he's bad or anything like that. But... But I am at this part, what I, at this point in time, I'm noticing, man, you producer niggas, y'all fire, bro. Y'all saving niggas. Y'all are the heroes because a lot of times it's the beat doing it for me, not the rapper. Not the rapper. Sorry. I'm not hating because I like this song right here. All Stars Hard. All Stars Fire, bro. I'm coming back to that one. Show. Show. But come on, man. We did trenches, right? We did trenches, right? We did that. Maybe we gotta listen to Trenches with the rest of Flex so it makes sense. Man, I'm giving Flex music 100% of a my 100% of a chance, you know? immaculate the beat gets when you just hear the beat they're calling me a beat writer The beat was great, man. The song had energy, of course. But the beat was great. <laughs> Take a look at what I did. Put you kissing that shit now.
honestly can't give you nothing Take you where you never been Overseas and I spent like 10 I just want some bands Head up what you said She said pick her up Beat her around like 10 Break on my pants It's on my drive fly But she ain't mine I've been pulling up for the 10th time Think I fell in love But she ain't mine Ain't mine song was good but it was like good to a part and then he's kind of switched the flow and then i kind of was like but what i like about the song most is that he finally used like a different flow the beats every beat so far 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 you know I me mean? like for sure the way he the way he delivered on this one, the fact that it has something else to offer, open my eyes. But then once I really, 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 really got invested and started to pay attention to what's going on throughout the entirety of it, I'm just like, yeah, I don't see anything I'm coming back to on the song. Beat though, hey, whoever produced this one right here, keep going, my boy. Your time is your time is near. Osama Sun's time is near too, but I want to make sure Osama Sun's time is now. You know what I'm saying? Everything I'm saying is just my opinion. You don't got to agree, and that does not mean Osama Sun is going to be a failure. It does not mean that he's not good. It does not mean anything. I'm just Uncle Mill giving my uncle opinion, you know? That's all. That's, how, that's, that's, that's all. One of the more better songs on the project. Wow. One of the more better songs in the project. Still not amazing compared to what the project has to offer so far. 3X. Good. Nothing. I like that he switched the vibe up a little bit. All Star. 
fire to me. Every beat on this shit, though, outstanding. Um, I've noticed this new recipe in the underground, though, where it's like, get a fire ass beat that just has this this electric aura to it. Ramble off on a different type of flow, and then repeat yourself until people think it's catchy. Three perks, that's it. Three perks, that's it. Three perks, that's it. That's the new creative catchy in the underground. You know, it's dumbed down. Like, you know when Drake was like, he says something real stupid. She said, do you love me? I tell her only partly. I only love my bad and my mom. I'm sorry. That's what I consider a small catchy part that I'm going to anticipate over and over and over and over and over again. Not three perks, that's it. Three perks, that's it. Three perks, that's it. Three perks, that's it. But if you have no choice, singing that part over and over and over and over and over and over and over again, it's obviously going to stick. No cap. It's obviously going to stick, but there's nothing cool about... Three perks, that's it. Three perks, that's it. Three perks, that's it. What you're really paying attention to is the way it's that catching on to that beat, my boy. It's the beat, my boy. The beat is crazy. Crazy. Three perks, that's it. That's not catchy. That's not a bar. That's not relatable. That's not hitting. No? Think I said, dare I say a whole lot of red effect. No, 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 no. No album has ever had the whole lot of red effect since whole lot of red drop. None. Everybody has tried to consider every album whole lot of red ever since whole lot of red did what it did. Y'all niggas was locked in the house. It wasn't for y'all niggas when y'all was locked in the house. When y'all got out the fucking house, y'all liked it. Because you realize the album is not to be listened to sitting on your fucking dairy ass. Your smelly asses. That, that was the whole lot of red effect. The pandemic. Don't y'all get it? Y'all was in the house. And then you got out the house and touched grass. This song gets a like already. This song gets a like. This song gets a like. Tell he low key ran out of something. My own top of shit. You got my shit. Add a big little fit. Damn it. I'm saying like, I. Boss of the flag. Boss of the flag. Boss of the flag. Boss of the flag. You see, what I see right now, what I see here is. And a year from now, 
or in Osama Sun's next project from now, instead of running out of words to say in a moment like this. In a project from now, in a year from now, he'll be able to keep that flow going, keep those bars going, you know, constantly be able to give us that extra plus of creativity and be able to say more. I know that for sure, you know what I mean? This is Uncle 8 talking right now, looking down at Lil Neff, like, hey, I see in a year from now, man, you're going to have more life to offer to these youngins, you know what I'm saying? I see the vision. I see the vision, but right now it's not it. But this song is definitely a lot better. Definitely a lot better. Definitely a lot better, bro. But you can't tell me that this is immaculate when you're running out of things to say. Now, there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. There's growth. You know, all that means is growth is on the way. I see that. That's why I'm not here to shit on Osama son. But I ain't finna let no hype, no Twitter views, no promo, no nothing confuse me into thinking this is the greatest shit I've ever heard. Nope. I like that part when he comes and took my option wrong. Yeah, uh, uh, uh. like when he switches that up. You know? Interesting. Yeah, let's get it on. Yeah, let's get it on. Yeah. Oh, Samuelson dropping a four minute song. It's crazy. You got the audacity. Audacity of he to have a four minute song with this type of flow. bit more of a vibe switch i respect that i like that something else to offer i'm glad we're not listening to the same flow that we've been listening to since track one 
This is about the second time he, to an extent, altered the way he sounded. But he did not completely execute on the flow. Did switch it up. Did. I think there might be another song in this. So that transition was immaculate. Oh, shit. Hold up. Run with Chanel. Baby, just tell me how you felt. Slime it, yeah. No, I can't fail. Slap on me, yeah. Now hear me out. Both those flows were tough. I think if Osama Sun were to find a way to just simplify, simplify the music, chop it up a lot more, let the beat do a lot more of its thing, use his auto tune type trap rock star ish kind of sound that he's going for. If that's what he's going for, I don't really know how to describe it, but. Whatever sound that he's going for, if he finds a way to just like use his bars less because they're not that interesting and cater more to the beat and the cadence, like the way he did with this, it was like, right, kill, you know, let it pause a little bit, let the beat do his thing and brought it back, whatever. And the way he was doing the little vocal effects in the background, bringing that aura to the song, slaps. Flaps. And the second part of this four minute track, way better than the first part. You know what I'm saying? But I think he just needs to just simplify it a little more. You know, because sometimes to an extent, it's too much of a mouthful of just stutter rap nothingness behind some immaculate 808s and a good beat and some great quality. But I don't heard too much of coming to New York and sipping lean. And, 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 you know what I mean? I, I, I didn't heard a little bit of much. It's a little much now. A little much now. You know? Dumb it down a little bit. Keep it catchy. Keep it short and catchy. Well, I can't see me. Six times, lost in the case, 
another beat writer. This was another beat writer. Beat for me. Not the flow. It was usually when it's not the lyrics, I look to the flow. If it's not the flow, I usually realize I'm paying attention to the beat. Like you ever catch yourself rapping to a song in your head on your own because the, the lyrics don't suffice? But thinking, what, what, what could I have said on? You don't even rap, but you just stick it to you. You know. Be right, all right. At one point, the flow got kind of fucking cringe. Yeah, halfway through, towards the end, it was kind of like, huh? I don't know. Next. Me when. Might have been too fast. Hot take. Hot take. Hot take. You know how the underground doesn't hmm, listen to songs for lyrics anymore? You know? You know how bad the underground the underground would be if lyrics counted? Because a big part of why the underground is flourishing right now is because lyrics don't count. As long as you're saying relatable, savvy, trendy things like for example, the generic 10 band count. We know you're not a millionaire, so 10 bands sounds believable. Um, the what your shooters will do talk, the where you're shopping at talk, the what your bitch gonna do talk. It's a formula, it's a formula and a combination with the lean and the perks and the zans. It's a combination of the same shit twisted and turned up to the point where as long as you're flowing using that sh that topic you up and that's why lyrics don't count in the underground really beat and flow but i'm getting good beats out of this but the flows are not catchy and not only that the lyrics are not hitting still so it's like, what am I supposed to be taking from that? Creativity? I know it's not, it's not like it's not creative, but if it's not something that I want to come back to, how creative could it possibly be? And maybe that's just myself. It is, maybe, not maybe. It, that's 100% just me, myself, and I. Facts. Nah. <laughs> 
Niggas are saying I'm pushing a lyric agenda. It's not true because there are so many other songs out there that I listen to that I'm like, oh, this is a vibe. Fuck everything else. This is a vibe. There are songs out there where I'm like, nah, this is some lyrical ass shit. You know what I'm saying? And there are songs in this project that I like, whether it was lyrics or not. And there, are, so like, y'all can't say I'm pushing a lyric agenda whenever I'm going to a song that doesn't have lyrics or flow. That's catchy. You can't say I'm hating when it's not it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it don't work that way. I was just in the air with Uno, rah rah looking for you know. Who they looking for, chat? Inform the eight. I said, ramble off by some shit, find a find a pocket to say some shit repetitively till people convince it's catchy. Rap about girls, lean, what you're shopping, and who you're gonna slide on. With a producer that sounds hard that nobody's heard before. Cuss the blogs. You got yourself a recipe in the underground. That song was better. Better, a lot better than what we've heard um, from Kills On. Not really too much of a fan of anything from Kills On. Straight flexing the beat. Kind of has some like techno ish, trappy ish kind of vibe. You know? Uh, was it magnificent? But it'll do because it finally, you know. Put a little pep in my step. 
Um, I'm not looking for anything lyrically, but I didn't get anything lyrically. Uh, I didn't really catch a catchy part of the song. I really any part of the at any given point of the track. Yeah, no, that song was ass. They like your congratulations, but you want your shit. I put a hell of a bit because I want some bitch. I look at the mother, bitch, I do that shit. Put a put up swerving, and they be like, who that? Bitch, I said the SRT or Tina, this a cool cat. Nigga, think you too bad. I got two locks for your blue eye. Nigga, push her, he get blue back. That's why I bought that song. This song's way better. Already get. If this song continues on being good for the next 30 seconds, it's getting a like. Just one car, uh, knock you off. Burn them cars, burn them foreign bras. Hit a whistle, bro. Out of love, that's how Sean love. Cause it fucked me up. I said, pull up. I'm a dope car. Put my trust. Let me know if I'm my trust. Who do I bust? I twin, I fucking bust. Suit it up. I ain't cut as far to be a bust. Going up. Congratulations, boy, you want your shit I put a hell of a mother cause I want some bitch I look at a whole team, my little bitch, I do that shit Put a put up swerving, and they be like, who the hell? Bitch, I said the SRT, OT, now this a cool cat Nigga, think you too bad, I got two locks for your blue eye Nigga, push up, he get blue back, twin, how about that song? Just one car, uh, knock you off Burn them cars, break them with foreign bras Hit a whip flip up, boy, I don't love That's how Sean love Cause it fucked me up I said pull up And I don't come Put my trust Let me know if I put my trust Who do I bust? I twin I fucking bust Suit it up I ain't cut for the be a bust Going up Going up Going up Hard Flow Melody Cadence Beat Aura Everything Fire Wasn't too long Didn't ramble off about bullshit for too long Um Catchy and all Hard that one was hard. That one shows me that Osama's son is promising. I ain't gonna say all that. That one shows me that Osama's son has potential. Project, I'm gonna save my, the rest of my takes for the end. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about, man. You took too fucking long, no. You took too fucking long to take it to this, to this extent. You took 16, it took you 16 songs to get here? Huh? I skipped the song. It took you, man, I'm pissed I skipped the song. I'm pissed.
But it ain't bad. It's not amazing. It's not atrocious. It's not repetitive like the rest. Matt with it. Last song, Talking to a Ghost. I can't believe it took him 17 songs to switch it all the way up. He does not deliver on this, on, on, on this vibe right here. It's going to say a lot to me. Say a lot to me. You can't switch it up all the way. Could be because I'm sick and tired of hearing all that repetitive, uh, not hard to make, super predictable other shit. You know what? The fact that he put that song out, right, on this project, makes this project a lot more ass than I thought it was. Because it's like, yo, you are talented, bro. You are talented, but you gave us 16 of the same. You gave them, you gave us 17 songs. You probably switched the flow three times on hard ass beats. Other than that, it was the same flow on every hard beat that this project had to offer. And then you switched it all the way up, and then you were finally good. Like, great. Sorry, chat. This project is not immaculate, bro. It's not amazing. There is not a single song I see myself spinning back to realistically other than this last one here, Talking to a Ghost. All this other shit, generic as hell, bro. Generic style of rap. Generic. Just generic. Super generic, man. And a lot of you guys are gonna dis you guys are gonna say, you know, you guys are having a lot of fun with the uncle thing. Y'all think it's cause I'm an uncle. Cool. You know what I'm saying? When I was not liking shit before, y'all wasn't calling me uncle. But now the uncle thing is cool. Y'all think I don't like shit cause I'm unk. I you know what I'm saying? This project, uh, it doesn't take anything away from Osama Son's career as an artist. I don't think this is the downfall. I do not believe any of that. The quality was amazing. The beat selection was amazing. This is his flow. His style of rap. And it is very opium inspired. Very. 
You know what I'm saying? But like to an extent, he does have his own way and wave and wave. So I'm going to respect that. I really don't. I'm really not going to try to tie anything he does to to the, to the to the opium members, you know, but like. It doesn't make it amazing. He's not doing anything better. So it's like. If, yeah. I see people saying this is better than a great chaos. It's absolutely not at all. I see people saying this isn't a great chaos ripoff. It's absolutely not at all. Um, it doesn't sound like a great chaos. Really at all. A great chaos is actually extremely one dimensional. This project is a lot more versatile than a great chaos. Um, because he tried to switch it up. He tried. The only versatile part of a great chaos was the features. Yeah. Hank Carson can't really rap any really other way. Really what he's talking about, that's different more than how he's talking about it. I think we've all understood that at this point. Um, A Great Chaos. I'm not about to compare Great Chaos to fucking Flex Music. It doesn't compare at all in any way. It doesn't scratch the surface of A Great Chaos. It doesn't have... A single song as electrifying as a great chaos. Uh, it's not in the same conversation as a great chaos. The only thing that brings a great chaos to any part of a conversation when it comes to flex music is the fact that it just recently dropped and he kind of sound like Ken Carson. That's it. Ken Carson's one dimensional project is better than this versatile, to an extent versatile version of Osama Sama. Was this project wasn't atrocious though? Like, yeah, I said it was ass, but what I really meant by that was just like, I had a lot higher expectations for this, you know, a lot higher. I thought I would come out of here with at least two songs. That's like, I right, dog. These shits I'm finna play for the next two days nonstop. When I listened to Net Spend 2024 freestyle, I didn't turn that shit off. I knew off the rip. Nobody had to convince me of anything. I didn't need to read a chat. I knew off the jump, and I was not a Netspin fan. That's happened for a lot of other artists. Netspin because they're in the same category. Hey. High expectations. Did not meet them. Project is a right. Don't see myself listening to this ever again. Talking to a ghost, I might. Yeah, I'm about to. Hills is all right. Boss up, all right. Why does this happen now? Why do they do this? They don't. They really don't want us unliking shit no more, huh? Crazy. Nothing, and I don't even remember what it sounds like. Boss up, and I don't really remember what it sounds like. Kills, I remember the two part song. All stars, tough. Congrats is cool. Talking to a ghost. Fucking with. Your boy A God. This is how I feel about Osama Sun's project. On to the next one. Until the next, you know what I mean, project that comes out. Uh yeah. Yeah. Let me know if you could agree, disagree in the comments. I wish the best for Osama Sun. What's the most successful dude? I pray he gets his fucking bag. I pray he gets to change his family's life. I hope this shit works for him, whether I like it, anybody else likes it or not. I hope you guys can respect my opinion. Um, and when he does put something out that's amazing, I will 100% acknowledge it. But this was rather... Eh, boy, hey God, before you get out of here, turn me up. Lock it with us on Twitch. Not a do it as you on Twitch. My apologies.